Hey guys, hope you're having a great day. Your buddy Tim back with yet another home tour for you. And today we are in Hazel Green, Alabama. Hazel Green is just uh, a little bit north of the city of Huntsville. We're about 10 minutes out, uh, 10, 15 minutes out. Far enough to be considered out in the country and uh, still close enough to be convenient to everything. So uh, I think you're really going to like this house. It is a beautiful three bedroom, two bath family home uh, built in 2003, but very well maintained. Still looks good. I walked in and I honestly thought I was in a uh, a much newer home. So, hey, uh, do me a favor before we get started. If you like what we do here on the channel, uh, click that subscribe button. Click the little bell notification icon. This is the bell. And give us a, a thumbs up. You can see why I don't do sign language because it would just be horrible. Anyway, just click subscribe so you don't miss another video. And don't forget, if you are thinking about moving to North Alabama, you need to give us a call. We've got Revolved Realty here. Uh, 82 agents, I think now, ready to go to work for you. You know, my phone rings every day from folks who reach out through this channel and want to know more about life here in North Alabama and if we can help them find the perfect home. And of course we can. So contact information is below. So, all right, let's get started with the home tour. We are at 129 Stafford Road in Hazel Green. Uh, the price on this home, $339.9. This home is priced dead on market. So if you've been looking for a home that has a lot of value, a lot of upside, this could be it. Uh, 1,959 square feet, three bedrooms, two bath. The roof is three years old. The water heater is new. The HVAC is new. Those are great because the roof, the HVAC, the water heater are typically the most expensive things to replace in a home. Well, you don't have to worry about that here. Uh, immaculate single family home sits on a half acre lot. You're going to love the land here um, in Hazel Green, just minutes from the high school built in 2003. Three bedrooms, two baths. It has a split floor plan, really big master suite uh, that you're not going to believe in a house of this size. This thing is huge. So nice bedroom, nice ensuite on this end of the house. And then back on the other end with the split plan, we've got two more bedrooms and a bathroom there. When you come in, we've got a dining room, living room, got a great uh, big kitchen as well as a, uh, an eat and breakfast area here. So hardwoods throughout, formal dining room, formal living room. Um, again, the outside space is great. It's got a good deck. I'm going to show you in just a second. So if you have been looking for something less than $350,000, uh, close into the city of Huntsville. This could be the home for you. Again, 129 Stafford Road here in Hazel Green, the price at $339.9. And that is a great price for this home. So, all right, that's it. Let's get the tour started. All right, guys, we are starting here at the foyer. Let me give you a, a quick look. Front door here, you walk into the foyer. You've immediately got really nice hardwoods. I believe these are probably nine foot ceilings and uh, got the good crown molding. So coming in from the foyer, if we go to the right or to the left, my left, your left, as we go to the left, dining room there, great room ahead, two bedrooms on this side, and then the master is through there. So we're going to uh, just come straight in off the foyer and we come into the great room and really nicely, uh, nicely decorated. Uh, again, this house was built, I believe, in 03, but maintained really well. It's got the uh, hardwood floors. The paint looks good. It has a tray ceiling there. I've got a gas log fireplace with a uh, tile surround. Give you a look back this way. And again, foyer coming in here. So if we go directly through here, we come into the kitchen. And this is the... The breakfast nook, got a lot of good light in this house. And then got a really good size kitchen. The cabinets look good. Got the Formica countertops. You know, if you were gonna do a, a remodel or an update, you might come in and put in granite, but it is certainly not necessary because it is a nice kitchen. Cabinets look really good. It's got the tile floor, dishwasher there, sink there. All right, and then that is going to be your pantry. And if we come back through here, this is the dining room. It does have the tall windows with the arc windows up at the top and a vaulted ceiling. And again, the hardwoods look 
fantastic in this house. They look really nice. So, all right. So let's go back this way and go to the master bedroom. Again, it is secluded on this end of the house. So if we go through, this is the master. And again, this master is huge. It's huge, Donald. This is larger than uh, some of the masters I see in homes twice this size. So got a really good master. The paint looks good. Has a tray ceiling with a ceiling fan. And again, the tall windows. These windows are the floor to ceiling type windows, which let in just a ton of light. And then this is the master. Realtor in the mirror. So double vanity here. Got a jacuzzi tub and then the water closet or what my mom always called the shitter. <laughs> my mom, you in class. All right, so then we've got a stand-up shower here and then we've got the walk-in closet here. So good size closet. And again, coming back through, you know, and it's a, it's a really good use of space. They've got the garden tub over in the corner. They've got the two vanities here in the front. So really good use of space. So this is the master. And if we go back through, the laundry area is here. Good size laundry. Okay, and this is nice here, a mud sink. My wife will tell you, she loves a good mud sink. Garage there, standard two car garage. Then if we go back through, the other bedrooms are on this side of the house. Now this one is uh, bedroom number two, which they are currently using as an office. Good size. The fact that the ceiling is high always makes a room look bigger. And that's very handy. Carpet looks good. Then closet there. Full bath here. Okay, got a pantry there, toilet. And then the third bedroom is here. And again, you got your nine foot ceilings, which make the room look larger. Yeah. And this room, this room has had some uh, flooring updates. All right. And then as we go back through here, we will come back into the great room. So uh, let's go outside and take a look at the ground, shall we? All right, so we're gonna come back through the great room and we're gonna go out onto the deck, let you see the outdoor space. Uh, again, this home sits on half an acre and you really don't realize how big half an acre is until you have one. Or, you know, what I used to say is you don't realize how big a half acre is until you attempt to cut it. So, all right. So you can see got a really good backyard. Your neighbor has a pool. So if you don't have a pool, what's the next best thing? You make friends with the neighbor who does. <laughs> all right, let me walk out of here. And we are right in the country here, so it is quiet. You are not gonna hear traffic. You are only gonna hear the birds and the bees. And then a car goes by. <laughs> All right, so giving you a good look at the outside here. The roof is new. HVAC is new, hot water heater is new. And you'll notice I get a lot of questions about uh, propane tanks. And what that is, when they develop these neighborhoods out in the country, um, usually there is no natural gas run. There's no gas company. So what you do is you get these propane tanks and you fill those with propane and that will fire up your uh, fireplace uh, and anything else that you need with natural gas. You can just run it directly off propane. But really like the deck, looks really good. The deck is facing the east, so in the afternoon you're going to get some shade here. It's going to be nice to sit out on the deck, but again, you got a half acre lot here, and uh, it's a really nice house on a really nice piece of ground. So, all right, let's go back in and we'll do a wrap up. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the tour. Let me do a sum up here. We are at 129 Stafford Road in the city. 
uh, or in the municipality of Hazel Green. We're kind of out in the country, but we're about 15 minutes north of the city. But again, uh, the way the uh, the area here is laid out is you're never very far from from civilization, as we like to say, shopping, restaurants, retail, close by. Uh, 1959 square feet, three bedrooms, two baths, uh, formal dining room, great room, good kitchen. Uh, it's got a breakfast nook. Master suite is really great. It is big. It is more than you normally see in a home of this size and this price range. And again, we're sitting on a half acre lot. So, hey, if you would like more information about this home, just let me know. My contact information is below. Be more than happy to send you more information. Or if you are looking to move to the area, uh, and again, we talk to folks every day moving here for work, for school, for retirement, uh, just because they heard it's the number one uh, best place in the country country to live, they are looking at uh, relocating here. So if we can help you in any way, let me know. Again, we've got Revolved Realty, 82 agents ready to go to work for you. And don't forget, if you like what we do on the channel, uh, click the subscribe button, click the little bell and uh, give us a thumbs up just to let us know that you enjoy these videos. So, all right, guys, that's it. I hope this was helpful. If I can do anything for you when it comes to real estate, do not hesitate to reach out. My information is below. All right. See you later. Ring, ring. Bye.